Hi there, everyone. This is Doctor Two K Seven, aka Sonic Sky Chaser. I hope you're having a fantastic Tuesday. Yes, tonight at nine o'clock, it's the NBA Finals, Game One in Phoenix, as the Milwaukee Bucks will play against the Phoenix Suns in this really good matchup. A matchup that both the media and the NBA fans are pissed off about. Yes, instead of the NBA, yes, to them, instead of them getting an NBA Finals featuring two big market teams, this matchup is consists of two small market teams, and they are pissed off about it. Let me tell you, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. I'm actually okay with this matchup. I really am because I'm so sick and tired of seeing big market teams being hi getting highlighted for some. Highlighted by both the NBA fans and the stupid sports fans. And also, and also, I find it fucking hilarious how the NBA fans who were pissed off at this matchup are the same ones who, are, who, who always complain about, oh, LeBron James always going to the NBA Finals every fucking year. Fucking year. I'm sorry. But you can't be upset about LeBron always appearing in the fucking NBA Finals every time, every time on a goddamn stacked team, but at the same time you can't be you can't complain that two small market teams are going to be playing. Honest and honestly, I think this is going to be help. I this is something that the NBA really does need because they need small because they need to see this. I mean, it, it, this is going to be pretty big and who knows? And they're pretty good, but of course you got the media pundits out here who's gonna be crazy. Oh, this is gonna be the lowest rating finals ever because it doesn't have big name star power. And it's against two market teams, against two small market teams. And to this, I have to say to the media this: and whose fault is that? Because if you think about it, every time when you, the sports media, always want to talk about teams, you always want to talk about big market teams like the Los Angeles Lakers, the Brooklyn Nets. The Los Angeles Lakers, the Brooklyn Nets, the Boston Celtics, the New York Knicks, the Miami Heat. The only reason why you talk about it because they're they're living in a big market city and they have big star power. And every and you don't and you don't show any of the small teams any love. I mean Milwaukee. I mean Milwaukee. They had to dealt with so much crap, crap many many times. They get into the playoffs and never make it to the finals. And so is the Phoenix Suns. I mean, you would think, you would think that maybe, just maybe, instead of you always want to focus on big market teams, you should mostly help focus on small market teams. But you guys don't. You do this every fucking time. And it ain't just the NBA, and it ain't just the NBA, though, that they do this, do this shit. They also do it for the WNBA, like anybody gives a fuck about that one. Um, the NFL, college foot, college football, NHL. MLB, you name it. Every time when a sport, every time when they talk about a sports team, they always talk about big market teams. They never give small market teams a chance. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. Which is why ESP. Which is why people. This is why I think people who who loves basketball like myself, I want to see this. I want to see this matchup because this matchup looks really fucking good. And and who knows? Who and besides, this whole oh it's gonna have the roller rating. Who the fuck cares about the ratings? I mean yeah I get the NBA, a NBA and ABC and ESPN cares about the fucking ratings, but seriously, what about the fans? Real fans like myself. I want to see this match. I'm go I'm I'm gonna see game one tonight. Let's be real. I'm gonna see game one tonight. And like I said, I did my pick last year. I did my pick last night. I really did my pick last night. I picked the Phoenix Suns winning in six games with Chris Paul being being named Finals MVP. And and no matter what happens, I will congratulate the winner, the winner of the NBA Finals, winner of the NBA Finals, because this is gonna be one hell of a fun game to watch. I can't wait. And like I said, for and for those of you who are upset. That this ain't the finals you want. You know you can just don't watch, right? You can watch something else, like watch CNN, even though CNN is full of shit anyway, or watch or watch Max Kellerman having a fucking meltdown, or or um, Stephen A. Smith 
or should I say Stephen A. Snitch, being an asshole for trying to shit on a team, trying to shit on the city of Milwaukee, all because his precious fucking Nets didn't make it. But anywho, we'll definitely see how this was. But anywho, I'm going to watch the NBA Finals. I'm going to watch these two teams play. Shit. Man, fuck anyone who's upset about this. Tough shit. I'm, I'm going to enjoy this game. It's going to be a goddamn, it's going to be hella fun, man. Hella fun. But that's just my two sets on the other thing. But I would like to know what you think about the whole situation. As always, be sure to leave a comment, like this video, subscribe to this channel, click the notification bell so you don't miss another update. Share with your friends, share with your neighbors, share with your significant others, and that's about it. Until next time, this is Darkside 2K7, aka Sun of Skies, this is I know. Thank you for taking the time out, y'all. Busy schedule. Schedule. Um, and I will see you soon. I'll catch you later. Peace. <sighs> At least LeBron's not in the fucking finals. Thank fucking God.